Hey, what's going on guys and welcome back. So today I have early, early access to Patch Quest on Steam. Now, for those of you who don't know, Patch Quest is not yet out. It's coming out on May 7th. But uh, Lemon, the developer, he gave me a review copy and I had asked him if it was all right for me to show some stuff off prior. And he said, yeah, go like basically go wild. Uh, I do want to remind you guys, you can wishlist this game on Steam right now to show your support. I will leave a link to it in the description. And uh, yeah, so, so let's check out some exclusive review copy footage. Uh, exclusive till the game comes out anyway. All right, let's, uh, let's see what we can do here. You know what? I, I think this time around I'm going to actually make a character that's not random. Ooh, this guy's hair. No, 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 no. Uh, the black's all right. My hair's pretty dark. Let's go. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> we'll give him the triangle nose. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let's give him some facial hair. I mean, my hair kind of looks like this now because I haven't been able to get a haircut because of COVID, but... Uh, oh, my God. <laughs> okay, you know what? Okay, wait, let's just let's just figure out. Okay, here he can have this hair. Maybe make his skin a little less orangey. Ooh, I'm not that white. Eh. I don't know I'm kind of like a I'm kind of like a tan, but I'm not this tan, but I'm also not this light, so I don't know. We'll just make him regular white. Okay, uh, skip intro intended for people who have already played the game. We will do this because if you guys have been around, I've played this game quite a few times. Uh, explore mode off, reduce challenge. No, no, we don't need that. Okay, name your uh, place. We're gonna name it Thick Boys like we have on every island because thick boys is the key to having a successful uh run it's you got to name your island thick boy this is i'm giving you guys some exclusive uh guides here all right thick boys 100 percent of the time all right let's do this oh, okay they got some uh objectives let's go to the jungle so if you are new to the channel, definitely subscribe for monster taming content. That's all I upload on here pretty much. Uh, monster taming games and or games with monster taming elements. Uh, sticky booster, eh. Shock booster, uh, I like the rat itch booster. Itchy type shots, let's go for the shock one. Yeah, uh, patch quest is, is a lot of fun. It's a very different monster taming experience. Most monster taming games are either turn ba are usually turn-based combat. Uh, very few monster taming games that have this sort of like bullet hell-esque uh, thing going on. Other than Xenoscape, it's pretty much just just these two. So I'm definitely happy to to play it whenever I get a chance. I need to capture a monster, but I guess we'll go with this one. Oh yeah. Defense skill, Dusk Dash. Glides through the air, releasing clouds of pollen as you go. All right, let's do it. So at the time you guys are watching this, there's a good chance uh, I'm actually physically not around. Uh, basically, I'm pre-uploading a few Let's Plays for the week that my uh, wife is supposed to go on labor. And basically my goal is to sort of have some content for you guys while I'm away. Because last time we were in the hospital for like five days. <laughs> so it's better to just have some videos planned out. But if not, if that's not the case, because um, the baby's actually due on the 20th of May. But doctor is saying it's probably going to be early. He's already huge. Uh, if not, then you guys will still be watching this before May 7th. So uh, we'll see when that when it ends up dropping. <laughs> but uh yeah, I, I do want to. I, I do want to try to get some like uh, interesting patch quest videos out, like uh, all the monsters explained. Uh, maybe some of like the um, 
maybe some of like the the different uh, fruits and stuff like explaining all that explaining the buff system stuff like that I think that'd be a lot of fun uh, you know like tip uh, oh god uh, right as I'm talking about uh, tips I was like yeah tips would be good and then I get hit uh, yeah some like tips for like new players stuff like that review is definitely coming like I, I want my goal is to have a review out on launch day that's my goal so hopefully fingers crossed I'm not stuck in the hospital for a week prior, but that's, that, that, that's why, like, like for me right now, recording this, it's, we're still in April. Um, I, I need to to make sure to play this so I can I can do a review. I've played lots of hours of the beta on Discord, but uh, the Steam launch is a little bit different. So definitely been a lot of updates um, throughout since, since since I started playing for sure. Okay, we got Rapid Fire, which is my favorite, but we'll save it. Save it for when we need it. A good example of things that have changed is um, back when I when I started playing, you actually, I, I mean, this wasn't that long ago, but you used to like have to time your reloads to, if you wanted to get that burst shot. Now, uh, basically, the bar fills up, whereas the bar used to drop off before. Uh, the buffs used to be different, like the statuses and stuff like that. Like a lot of stuff used to be different. Ba back in my day, the whole world map was actually different as well. Your mount just gained an attacking skill. All right, let's actually utilize it, unlike the defending skills. That's my defending skill. I always forget to use my uh, my skills. Come here, buddy. Oh my god, I took another hit. Uh, all of your mount skills will deal extra damage. And we got some health. Jeez. I feel like the, the rapid fire might have been nerfed. I mean, I think they shoot more bullets, but each bullet does less damage. So maybe it's not necessarily a nerf. But uh, yeah, I think it's been changed. N not not 100% sure, but let's capture this. So you can capture different plants and stuff too. Uh, and then put them on your sword, on your, your home base. So that your subsequent runs are a little bit easier. Uh, oh. I gotta get out of here. The turtle's all right. Like the turtle's not a bad, um, not a bad mount to have. Not my, not my pick though. Guess here we are. So uh, the game, the game used to have a map that was more like just sort of spread out. Like, like, like you can go every direction. It's pretty much the same. But he did make it different, um, incorporating more, more Metroidvania aspects. So right now, as you can see, there's a, a wall here. Uh, I think I, I have to unlock it from the opposite side, and then it'll open up the gate so it's easier for me to get through it later. There's also walls uh, blocking all of these. So if I want to unlock those to be able to use them at the start, i got to make my way up here. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to try to unlock the north exit. Also got to keep, keep an eye on that... Uh, battery in the top right corner that's actually how much energy your mount has left once it runs out it's done but uh so there's another update that's newer uh now when your mount actually successfully uses a skill it doesn't lose it doesn't lose a uh, thing it actually gains it so this is actually very helpful so you can have each mount longer which i think is cool uh, I don't know if I, I don't really like these slimes either. I'm, I'm waiting. Most of my favorite guys are in the planes. Most of my favorite um, mounts to use. And then another example is I, I don't. I'm not a. Oh wait, let's see. Boost the power of your poison type shots. That's okay. If you take it, you're gonna you're gonna end up in a fight, right? So I'll pass. These are just mini monsters. 
I don't think I have the ability to catch... No, I don't have the ability to catch them yet. That's something you can unlock. Uh, let's grab this. Okay. Ugh. These guys aren't half bad. Those uh, spiky guys, but I'll show you guys my favorites when when, when uh, we get when we get out of the forest. Uh, I gotta get stuck. Ah, oh, damn it! Sticky, stick to stuff. I love it. So now you can get two two uh, debuffs instead of uh, originally it was three, then it went down to one. Okay, unleashes a quick fire raid. Okay. Boost the power of your frozen type shots. I don't have frozen type shots. Okay, um. Yeah, we're about to enter the mountains. Or the plains, or whatever they're called. These ostriches can be really annoying to fight against, too. Actually, all these guys are pretty annoying to fight against. <laughs> Ooh, I took, ah, I took a hit. I didn't even realize the bats were there. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, I'm getting stuck to stuff. Gotta watch out for that status. I might have just reset the spawns. <laughs> Need some energy. I think I can just keep. I think I can just leave. Yeah, I can. Oh no. Oh, here he is. This is the hills. That's what it's called. My. Oh, I just got smacked. Okay. Ah, oh, I just got smacked again. Okay. I gotta be careful. What the heck? Oh, my guy ran out of energy. Okay, that's fine. I want him. This is my boy right here. This is one of my boys. Oh no, I'm stuck. <laughs> oh wait. There. Okay. Status is gone cleanse plant or whatever it's called oh there okay this guy's defensive ability is pretty good gives you a bit of a shield Okay, where are we headed? Okay. Oh, give me the banana. Uh, I don't want to waste these homing shots because they're actually pretty good. Shotgun. Yeah, I'll use a shotgun first. Shotgun's pretty good too. Oh, there's a big one. Okay, the big ones are better. They get more energy. You have, to, you have to circle them twice, though. But as long as no one spawns until... I, I don't think anybody's going to spawn until this big guy's dead. Now he's small, because I circled him. There. Oh, who's the last one? Perfect. Okay. I believe this is the way. So let's head down. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Free buff. Melee black. Okay. Cool. That's basically when you're close to something. Sometimes they get, they get like, slapped. I'm not 100% sure how it works, but they'll make it better. Rapid fire, okay. I'll take this random tree. Get out, son. Oh, wait, give me gun stuff. Charge blast is stronger and more explosive. Oh, oh.
No! There. Give me this. Okay, um... Can I? Oh, you can take these. Okay, sweet. Okay, now we have one of those. Because why not? Uh, I think I might have passed it. No, no, we're still... Okay, we're still on the way. This is another one of those uh, events. There's a health thing here. So maybe we can backtrack and grab it so I can grab some extra health after this. No, that's one big, yeah, so we gotta break, basically break it. Let's try melee blasting it. R stick and RT. I didn't even know that, okay, that, so that's how you do it, okay. So now whenever we enter the new area, oh, sorry, whenever we enter the map, we can go to this new area. So the hills are now unlocked. So I have, I have a couple choices here. I can further explore the hills, or I could try to unlock all the areas so that in my subsequent runs I have more options. Uh, there's also health here, which I really do want to get. Uh, there's some enemies here. So I'm thinking, I, I, I'm just thinking here, I'm going to go get the health. Maybe I'll continue up the hills this way. Because there's also areas on the outer on like the outer perimeter too that are uh not part of the four default areas so there, there is more than four areas in this game uh so maybe we'll go let's go get the health and then uh we'll continue ah. okay health is down here oh no it's my little pony Okay. Cool. Okay, so we're healed up a little bit. Let's go. Let's go explore the danger. Get out of here. We don't need to waste our time fighting all these guys. We could just go right past them. I think that's another thing that changed. You used to have to fight like everything to proceed. I think. I could be wrong about that. That's how I was playing originally. Okay, Turbo will get me through here. Alright, let's go fight some danger. <clears throat> Oh, I almost got hit by that. Oh, it's a homing shot. Okay. Gotta be careful. Alright, danger. The ground shakes. This is gonna be a mini boss. Yeah, so th th this game definitely can get a little bit crazy with all the stuff that's going on on screen. So like you're trying to look at your enemies, you're trying to look at where you are. Uh, that That's one issue I sometimes... Oh god, I almost got hit there. That's one issue I get sometimes is I I'm focusing too much on my enemies that'll run right into something. And I mean, that's just a sentiment to like how much focus you have to be able to have to do stuff here. There we go. You have to have a lot of spatial awareness. Ooh, I got hit. Uh, I was able to use that as a shield. 
Yeah, when my when my fire collides with stuff, I can use it as a as a shield too, which is which is nice. Oh, I thought I had it. <laughs> I ran into that bullet. Okay, he's dead. All right, let's go rapid fire. He's dead. He's dead. And I put damage on that. You jerk. He's dead. Level three. All right, so we got our last uh, our last shot. Oh, we got more enemies to fight now. Oh God. We're getting smacked. I only got 11 health. Oh God, I got less. I only got three health left. Might die here. Okay. Okay. Yeah, the big the big boys seem to do more damage. Oh, <laughs> that was pretty scary. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, I can't see because the map. Ah. Yeah, the map kind of gets in the way sometimes. It's nice having it though, because then you can see where you're going, but it does get in the way sometimes. Okay, uh, okay I, need to, I need to add some energy onto this guy. Oh, 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 I got hit in the bum. Oh, I got hit in the bum again. Tired. We're gonna need a new Mon. Oh. We gotta, oh God. Oh no. Okay, I'm gonna keep on. It's too dangerous to try to capture here. Okay, capturing this guy, I guess. Oh, buddy. No, I don't want him. He sucks. Ah. Okay. Oh no, I died. <laughs> we died. Yeah, we definitely died. We made some discoveries though. All right, so so we also get uh, for disco for di discovering uh, other stuff, our explorer rank goes up, and we get to actually get uh, perks from it. So we get to choose two right now because we went up two levels. So. You can tame small critters as one of them. So you got lasso, blaster, mountain clothes, uh, clothes. So this this will. Um... That's kind of good. After you take damage, you can clear out clear out the area. So we're gonna do this so we don't take like ten hits in a row. Uh, you can charge your mount's attacks for a fifty percent bonus power. Uh, you'll grip better and slide less while your lasso is on lock on. Um, you can tame small critters. Melee, melee a plant to temporarily gain its ammo effects. This works on all plants that can shoot. Uh, we got taking damage would defeat you. Dismount. And, if taking damage that would defeat you, dismount instead. That's good. Okay. That way if you're riding something, you're about to die. You don't actually die. Definitely, definitely something good to have. Awesome. Boop, bop, beep, bop. Beep, 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 bop, boop. So as you can see here, we, we got a little more of the map unlocked. And yeah, all, all your little things that you get, you can sort of uh, put wherever. I mean, the cleansing plant's probably not that useful in your home base. 
I'm I'm honestly I'm not a hundred percent sure exactly how how it works to be honest. Uh, I definitely got to learn more, especially before. So I've added the objective pins. Okay, that's cool. Oh, these okay. So these are the monsters we've we've uh, unlocked, which I think is really cool that they have like a sort of like a bestiary uh, Pokedex type deal. Uh, capture some unique and wild plants. Unravel the mysteries of the island. And then you could choose where you want to go, right? So I'm gonna go to the hills. I, I don't know what I just took. I just took the first one I saw, so. So from here, let's go this way. Or you know what, we're gonna go the same way we went. Let's see if we can uh, conquer, conquer the area. Conquer that, that little bridge that we died on. Come here. Oh God, I got hit already and I'm dizzy. That's rude. So I'm just gonna run straight across. No need to waste time on the, oh shoot. That's kind of the risk I guess with uh, with just running at the screen. You can't really see what's going on. Okay, I actually want that big guy. He's got more energy. Yeah, get mad, bro. Angry, you mad, bro? Okay. Oh God, I got hit. Ah. Oh my god. Buddy. Okay. I'm running out of energy. When you take damage, you lose energy. You gotta be careful. Actually, I don't know what happens if you if you get if you lose energy while lassoed. It doesn't matter. <laughs> oh, 50. Okay, so he did they did get a nerf. They used to be 60. Not a big fan of the explosive shots. They're kind of slow. They do more damage, granted, but I like the speed. I like stuff with a lot of speed. Okay, another big boy. Mad bro? I'm not gonna get hit by you ten times again, right? All right, we're on the road to Viridian City, boys. Okay, we got some more, some more danger. This is where we got, this is around the, well, we went further, but we're getting towards where we got wrecked, so. Come on, bros. These homing shots are pretty good. <laughs> Basically shoot wherever you want and focus on just staying away from everything. I had my ability. Guess not. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, I'm getting sucked down because of this stupid thing. Okay. Get the heck out of here. 2 HP. I'm 
low I'm low energy I need to get more I need to hit him with something get hit damn it okay I got a little bit of energy from that oh no there's more damn you got tired like it's GG from here boys <laughs> But that's basically the point of the game. The point of the game is to explore new areas, get killed, bring with you what you had uh, discovered in that area, and then through gaining levels and stuff like that, the game does get subsequently easier because you get access to better perks, you get access to, um, your monsters will on average have higher levels because you've um, like leveled up more of them and stuff like that. So. That's basically the idea. The game is a Metroidvania and a roguelite kind of meshed in together with a, with a bullet hell. So it's a lot of fun. Like, I highly recommend when this game does come out, checking it out. I've put, on the on the Discord version, which is like the beta, I put at least 30 hours into that. I remember I had one session that went for like eight hours straight. No lie. I played it all night. Uh, it, it's definitely a really fun game. Um, I can't recommend it enough. But I'm going to unlock a perk, and then we are going to call it a day from here. So let's go, uh, I don't really care. Okay, we'll, we'll do this one, make it easier to, to catch stuff. I don't. I didn't really care too much about catching the small guys. They're not that great. They are, they are decent, like like they'll act as like support for you. You don't actually ride them. But uh, yeah, so let me know what you guys think of uh, Patch Quest, uh, how you think it looks. I, I personally think it's a really sharp uh, game and I, I can't wait to explore all the areas and whatnot. Like the 6% up there at the top, that, that, that needs to increase. Anyways, um. Definitely uh, make sure to let me uh, know your guys' thoughts. Uh, you can like and subscribe to the video if you do enjoy monster taming content. And uh, follow me on Twitter, GymLeaderAd. I'll, ch I'll check you guys out in the next one. Peace.